HIV Prevention – Why Pep Medicine Matters After Exposure Imagine a single moment, a broken condom, a needle prick, or an unplanned encounter, that leaves you wondering, what now? That's where PEP, or post-exposure prophylaxis, steps in. This emergency HIV medication, when taken within 72 hours, can mean the difference between infection and protection. In this video, we'll break down exactly how PEP works, who it's for, and why every hour counts. Whether you've been exposed or just want to be prepared, understanding PEP could save your life, or someone else's. Sometimes, life surprises us. A quick decision, a small accident, or a moment we didn't plan for, suddenly, we might wonder, was I just exposed to HIV? HIV is a virus that attacks the immune system, the part of our body that fights off sickness. But here's something important, if you think you've been exposed to HIV, there's a medicine that can help right away. It's called PEP, short for post-exposure prophylaxis. Today, the most common medications used for PEP are a combination of powerful HIV-fighting drugs. Doctors usually prescribe tenofovir, entricitabine, and raltagravir or dolutegravir. These medicines work together to stop the virus from copying itself inside the body. Tenofovir and entricitabine are often combined into one pill called Trivada, and it's taken once a day. Then, either raltagravir or dolutegravir is added as a second pill, taken once or twice a day depending on the type. These drugs are very good at blocking the virus if taken every day for 28 days without missing a dose. They're also generally safe, though some people may feel tired, nauseous, or have mild stomach problems during treatment, but those side effects usually go away quickly. PEP is like an emergency shield. It doesn't cure HIV, but it can stop the virus from taking hold in your body, if you act fast. You need to start PEP within 72 hours, that's three days, after the exposure. The sooner, the better. Even waiting 24 hours can make a big difference. Let's break it down, imagine you stepped on a sharp object or had unprotected sex with someone whose HIV status you don't know. Maybe you were a healthcare worker who got pricked by a needle. All of these are times when PEP could be life-saving. PEP is a pill you take once or twice a day for 28 days. That's about four weeks. During that time, the medicine works quietly inside your body, fighting the virus before it can make you sick. It's not a magic fix. You have to take every single pill, on time, without missing any. If you stop early or skip doses, the virus could still win. But when taken correctly, PEP is over 90% effective. And no, PEP is not for regular use. It's not the same as PrEP, which is taken before exposure. PEP is for emergencies only. If you ever think you need PEP, don't wait. Go to a hospital, clinic, or call a health provider. You won't be judged, PEP is part of taking care of your health. Knowing about PEP gives you power. Power to protect yourself. Power to act fast. And power to make sure one mistake doesn't become a lifetime of illness. So spread the word. Tell your friends. Keep this knowledge in your back pocket. Because when it comes to HIV, every hour counts, and PEP can save lives.